Creativity is the fundamental beadstock to the way that we design our medicines. Drug invention is creative in terms of how do I put the molecule together, how do I make that in the lab. There's creation at every stage through the invention process. My name's Andrew Wilkes. And my name's Chris Burns. And together we invented the drug monolotinib for the treatment of myelofibrosis. I discovered a class of enzymes called the Jack family of kinases. There are four Jack enzymes. They were very important in how normal blood cells and cancerous cells formed. Myelofibrosis is a bone marrow cancer that is caused by mutation in Jack 2 Mutated Jack 2 is overactive and that too much signaling is what causes the cancer. When we started out on this journey, most myelofibrosis patients would succumb to the disease in about six years. If they didn't, they were very likely to convert to a leukaemia. Mermolotinib is a small molecule and you essentially switch off that cancerous signal. When we eventually tested mermolotinib in patients with myelofibrosis, we started getting data back very quickly. So there was a clear readout that the drug was actually working and improving people's lives. Once we started getting the positive clinical data from the trials, we got a lot of interest from pharmaceutical companies around the world in licensing this compound and developing it further. The ultimate success of Mimolotinib proves that you need to work collaboratively. It's very much a team sport and there are people with extraordinary domain expertise. It really does take a village. It's a great joy and, and a great privilege to have been part of that. The Prime Minister's Prize for Innovation is absolutely the icing on the cake. This is such a wonderful recognition of myself and Chris and our teams been able to deliver. Something that we did here in a lab in Melbourne has now been turned into a pill that people take and actually improves their lives. That's, that's a huge reward personally and for everyone involved in the development.